A and his four friends when attempted to commit theft at B's place there was resistance and when the hurt was caused it shall be an offense of dacoity on the part of A and his four friends so the answer the option shall be D question number 82 uh, an, assemb an assembly which was initially lawful can turn into an unlawful assembly by the subsequent acts of its members it does not require previous concert in the sense that it does not require the consensus to make it an unlawful assembly at the very beginning the subsequent acquiescence can turn it into an unlawful assembly so the answer shall be D both B and C the option is D question number 83 uh, use of no physical force is not an essential requirement for uh, converting the offense of theft into that of robbery so the option shall be b commission attempt or fear of offense question number 84 uh, when x finds y's purse and he asks money uh, from y to uh, return the purse y does not pay and x does not return the purse so uh, the uh, this X shall not only be liable for uh, extortion or an attempt to extortion uh, if you see this extortion and attempt to extortion although in the definition uh, section that is section 383 uh, attempt to extortion is there in the illustration A and it is defined as extortion itself but in these options we do not find any difference between attempt to extortion and extortion so going with option A shall be safe also X shall be liable for criminal misappropriation so the answer shall be option D question number 85 uh, uh, under section 300 exception 3 we find that when a public servant exceeds the powers given to him by law it is an exception to the offense of murder so the option shall be C question number 86 uh, in this case uh, A shall be guilty of pickpocketing because if we see illustrations appended to section 5 double 1 IPC they make impossible attempts as an attempt under section 511 so even if uh, the pocket of B was empty a shall be liable for the offense of pickpocketing however murder is intentional killing for which A shall not be liable <coughs> because he did not intend to kill B question number 87 of course age of the victim plus sex of the victim 16 years if male and 18 years if female they both are uh, essential for the offense of kidnapping under IPC intention is not relevant here question number 88 uh, when it was a regular supply contract uh, a failing to pay to make payment to b despite re uh, repeated reminders a shall not be liable for breach uh, uh, for cheating or for uh, uh, the offense of cheating uh, because uh, we cannot infer dishonest intention on the part of a right from the moment when the contract was entered upon there is nothing on the face of it on the facts given which uh, indicates towards the presence of dishonest intention on the part of a when it was a regular supply contract so it shall only be a breach of contract S question number 89 this question is based straight on section 296 ipc question number 90 uh, 304 b ipc requires death under circumstances which were not normal so the answer shall be B 